Hi and welcome to this Savannah Shop uh, video. We are in September 2023 and we are up at Tyree, in fact exactly God's Bay. And this is my first try of my new PK1. So, Severn PK1, as you know, Severn have been uh, a little bit uh, thin on the ground with uh, harnesses for the last six, seven months. And uh, basically it was as they changed suppliers, so manufacturing uh, bases. Uh, but together with that, we've also then, so we brought back the, the air, the classic air that everyone knows. Uh, but uh, alongside it, we brought back the uh, PK1. Uh, so uh, it's Philip Costa's signature harness, uh, so he had a lot to do with it. And what's the key difference between this and the Air, which is by far our biggest selling uh, harness? Well, the main thing is, it's hard. This is a hard shell uh, here. Now, the first thing uh, that Steve, one of the team riders, kind of said is, oh, you know, it's going to be heavy. Uh, well, the answer is no, it's not. Uh, with the new composite materials they're using, uh, this is uh, really light and I kind of measured it and it's slightly heavier than an air to begin with so that's how it fares. Uh, other than that we have uh, new composite materials inside so if we open this up you can see that in there okay uh, really good I mean that really grips your back the, 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 uh, the harness does not turn I found it exceptionally good for that. Uh, so they've kept the same quick release and why not? It's a brilliant system. It's worked exceptionally well for the last few years. And so, you know, why do you need to change it? Windsurf specific, uh, specific hook, uh, which all uh, Severn harnesses have. Uh, and so, you know, what's my thoughts? Well, I used an air for a long time. Uh, and before that, I used a uh, Ion uh, Galito. Uh, because they are light and they're manoeuvrable, uh, which is what I liked. And the key thing I liked about the air was it was very light. It stayed light even when it got wet. Uh, so, using this today, uh, again, it's stayed very light because it's got a hard shell. So it's really only the lining here, which is exactly the same as the uh, uh, the, the air harness. So it stays uh, very light. Not quite as light as the air, but still stays very light. But the key thing you will notice uh, is that, so I noticed with this, is it's no bulkier than an air, but it's stiffer than an air. Now you may go, Neil, that's pretty obvious. It's a hard shell. Well, yeah, it may be pretty obvious, but that's exactly how you feel. When riding this, I just felt it was more engaged to me, more linked to me. I was more intrinsically locked to the harness. Uh, whereas the harness, uh, the air harness, uh, is, is very flexible and very light, uh, but almost feels invisible, which was its design remit. So I'm not knocking it, that's what it's designed for. This feels more locked into you and you feel much more engaged in what you're doing with it. Uh, I like it, I like it, I like that feel. Uh, uh, because the key thing is, is unlike uh, the Lux of, of old, which felt bulky, felt really big, uh, this doesn't. This feels light, agile, but it's just more engaged. Comes in, I think it's two colorways. This is the, uh, the gray, comes in black as well. Uh, and uh, so we have them in stock now. Uh, uh, Price-wise, about 200 pounds, there or thereabouts. No, it's 269, sorry. Uh, uh, but very well built. If you're looking at the manufacturing on it, very well built. So they have done the right thing with moving to a new supplier. Previous uh, airs had a few problems with the, the skin peeling. The new ones don't have that problem anymore because the print is now part of the fabric. Uh, so yeah, big step forward in all Severn harnesses. But PK1, yeah, entirely. Big thumbs up for me, I like it.